Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. It's Kim with Kim's Inspired Life and welcome to Monday. Hashtag Let's Do Die Cutting Monday, which is an open collab hosted by our friends Tree at Tree Craft On and Kathy, Kathy's Creative Crafts and more. And guys, this is what I'm working with today. Things are so random in my craft room sometimes, but I was going through, you know, as we do, what am I gonna, going to do for Monday? And I found these two things that I had stuck. They were kind of like wedged between where my die cut are in a drawer and um, this, I have this like bucket in there. Anyway, they were kind of wedged between there and I said, oh my gosh, I pulled them out and forgot that I had them. So what this is, what these are, is our adhesive sheets. It says permanent. Um, and it says double-sided, double-faced, 10 sheets. And it shows you how, I guess, you know, you run them through a little sidekick. <laughs> Tim Holtz um, thought that was cute. <clears throat> okay, so this is number 663051, six, three, adhesive sheets, permanent. I guess you're supposed to use them for stickers? is what I'm thinking. So tell me if you've bought these before. And I am i can't remember why I bought these, maybe with the idea to make stickers at some point. And I, I remember when I got them, I thought, ooh, these are a little bit smaller than I thought they were gonna be because, you know, I'm sure I didn't look at the size. Right here it says two and a half by four and three quarters right there. I found these also, the Stamps of Life Adhesive Sheets. And so this doesn't even say the size on the outside, but we can see that these are six by six. Yeah, just wanted to make sure, thought, think, thought they were. And so let me open them up. And I remember buying these on scrapbook.com thinking that I was gonna use them to make a shaker is what I what I was thinking that you that I would die cut out you know the top part and then that would stick onto the foam and I'm still going to do that but I just wanted to show those show this to you it says peel here slowly <laughs> so I guess right here so you can see that. that's the part that you peel off and then this is the sticky part right here right okay so I just wanted to show you those just because I found those in the drawer but I'm not using those today what I'm gonna do is I'm going to use these little cute things and I don't think I ever showed these to you look at how cute these are my first and only ever Lawn Fawn stamps and die that I own. I bought these when I was in Hawaii. I just thought they were so cute. You can see it says Aloha, the pineapple, a few little faces, which I don't think I would stamp those. I'd probably just get out my black pen and you know, draw those on. And then this says, I pine for you. That's so cute. And then the little die cut is just the pineapple and then the sunglasses, right? So I'm thinking that I'm going to get a sheet of, um, you know, just white paper, and then I'm going to put this um, sticky on it, and then I'm going to stamp this, and then die cut it. I think that's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> Hope it works. I'll come back and let you know. Okay, so I got out my Stampin' Up foam pad right here, <laughs> and I stamped a whole bunch. So, of course, I just went through the rainbow. Why do I do this all the time? I love the rainbow. <laughs> Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, pink. I started with this just cream color and then this um, teal color. Okay, so that's going to be a lot of pineapple cutting, right? I can make cards with these. I can put them on Memdex. They're small enough to put on an ATC. A Twinchy? Are these small enough to fit on a... Ooh, yeah. Okay, so I can use them on Twinchies. And then, guys, look what I did. I stamped this on the back of this um, paper, this glittery kind of paper. I hope that that works. Do you think it's going to work? Um, because if so, I have all these different colors. You see WV... It's Brights and Brilliance, and I don't know what size this is. And um, this I got in a, um, I think that I bought the, got this in a D-Stash or something. So I don't know, look at all these different colors. If that works and the stamp is okay, then I can do some more in these colors. How fun is that, right? So, okay, let me be quiet and go. And what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna take one. I'm gonna peel this off. I'm gonna stick it on the back of here and then I'm going to die cut it, right? Yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna do. Okay, I'll be back, and we're back. 
Oh my gosh. First, I just want to do a little mini review on these sheets. These are so sticky, guys. If you have never used these adhesive sheets, you should try them if you're in the market for something like this. They're so sticky. Okay, so what I decided to do was I cut two sheets of each so that way I could do just one just without the stickiness and one um, with the stickiness. So I didn't cut out um, all of these. I still have these to cut out, but I did cut out all of these. Aren't they cute? Oh my gosh. Look at these cute little pineapples. Oh my gosh. And then some of them have the sticky on the back. So those are just ready to just peel off and just put on your little project. And so I did um, cut some out of that the shimmery glittery paper um, and so you know you can see obviously it doesn't have the lines on but I think that's cool just for like to use for like a background or I could even you know cut the sunglasses out die cut the sunglasses and then put those on the little pineapple so excited to use them and I think I'm going to try to find a little um, maybe I have a little just a punch that I can punch them onto or maybe just fussy cut after I um, die cut that out to go along with my pineapples. So I just think they're cute. Okay, so let me know what you think. Have you ever bought these adhesive sheets before? How do you use them? Do you use them when you're making shakers? And so I'm going to go and I'm gonna cut the rest of these out. But guys, have a happy Monday. Hashtag let's do die cutting Monday. Thank you again to our wonderful hostesses and to everyone that's posting today so we can see all of your great die cuts. Okay, guys, talk to you again soon. Happy Monday. Bye-bye.